For fall-like temperatures, it might be a nice time to hit your road, hit yep. the road on your motorcycle. Nick Franchette with Law Tigers is joining us live. Nick, good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being with us today. Oh, it's great to be here. Now, Law Tigers, you work closely with um, injured motorcycle riders and their families. What safety advice do you have for us as people are hitting the road? Well, for riders, just make sure your, your bike's sound and everything's running properly there. But as far as for people that are in cars, make sure you watch out. Always look twice before you go through an intersection or make any turns, even changing lanes, because motorcycles are very well hidden on the road sometimes. Yep, good, good tips and reminders for all of us. And I know you have a couple of events coming up that you want to share with us. Yes, yeah, so uh, September is going to be busy. We actually start um, this Sunday in Cassidy, Kansas, which for people that don't know, that is a bike run that started in 1991, and it is the first Sunday of the month, March through October, in Cassidy, Kansas. And um, you never know how many bikers are going to show up out there. But we'll be there this Sunday set up, and the theme for this month is uh, first responders. We're giving thanks to them and all the stuff that our first responders do for us, especially now of all times. Um, and then Monday, I will be actually here in Topeka at Heartland Park for a track days. And so it's an opportunity for not only racers, but everyday riders to get out on a track and hone their skills in a very controlled, safe environment. And um, Hector St. John with St. John 27 Racing puts it on. They can go to stjohn27racing.com to find out more information on it. Um, but September is going to be very busy. We go from there. I have a few weeks um, in our area, but then I end up at Lake of the Ozarks, the 18th and 19th for the bike rally and most of it's around Bagnell Dam. It'll be a pretty fun event. We are actually helping sponsor a most horsepower contest. Oh. So people can take their bike and they put it on a dyno and they get a spreadsheet of how much horsepower they have. And there's a few other um, people sponsoring it in the area with the Harley shop and a few other places down there joining us and that's going to be a fun event. And then the very next week we go to Northwest Arkansas. And so Specifically, Rogers is where we'll be set up, but there'll be stuff at Eureka Springs and Turner Bend along some of the great rides around there. And the whole, with everything going on right now, the whole idea is just ride. Just ride. So, just yep. ride. Well, you know, Sturgis just wrapped up yep. a couple weeks ago, and that always draws a pretty big crowd yes. as well. But it's nice to see that there are events and activities happening a little yep. closer to home yeah. for riders, too. It's in, um, from Sturgis, the next biggest event that happens is normally the one that happens in Arkansas this year with everything going on. It's a little bit different. Even Sturgis this year was different than years past, but um, the biggest thing with motorcycle riders and when you're on your bike, uh, there's no better way to social distance. So. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it is a lot of fun. I actually attended Sturgis oh, and yeah. um, it was good to be up there and see all the people getting out and riding and doing it very safely and um, taking precautions for others around them. Well, I hope that people don't need your services. Same. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, but if they do, how can people find out more information about Law Tigers? Yeah, they can just reach us at 1-800-LAW-TIGERS. Go to lawtigers.com. They can also follow us on social media at Law Tigers Kansas okay. on Facebook. Nick, thank you so much for thank being you. with us today.